I ordered one shakedown shrimp taco and I added cheese. I also got one fried avocado taco and I am putting on lettuce wrap. Here's the OOTD, a girl outfit. You ready? That place was packed. So I'm glad we ordered in advance. Like literally every table was full and there were people waiting outside to go inside. So we're gonna have some bomb tacos. <laughs> I'm not a hater on the lettuce taco, but look how stupid this lettuce taco is. What is that? <laughs> it's like the whole thing of iceberg <laughs> lettuce. What's up guys? Good morning. Today is Sunday. I am attempting to be vegan for 24 hours, so those tacos last night were my last supper. Um, of course, today we got a lot of snow, so I don't know if we're gonna be able to go anywhere. I do have tofu, and I do have a couple things in the fridge that I think I think are vegan. I mean, I know tofu is vegan, but a couple other things. Anyway, let's make some coffee. So I just made a Cremota coffee by Heathen Zane, and I'm gonna use this Plant Folk Coconut Creamer that I got at Trader Joe's a couple days ago. I usually use um, plant-based creamers, like almond milk creamer, so this is no different than normal. Vegan breakfast time. I usually honestly have um, toast with raspberry jam, so I'm not feeling too different yet. Breakfast. Justin and I just discussed. I think I'm like 90% a vegetarian already. Today's gonna be a breeze. My mom tried to offer me these fiber gummies because they're delicious, but they're not vegan. There's gelatin in them. I'm hungry for a snack. Mom, I need a vegan snack, mom. Sherry's going to make her world famous hummus for the people. Fresh new garlic, fresh new garlic. One can of undrained chickpeas. Garlic. New York City. So I just got home from my mom's and I really wanted a snack. So I'm snacking on these vegan chocolate date balls that I made like a week ago. Um, but they're really, really good. I'll link the recipe below. I am starting to learn that a lot of stuff that I eat, like these waffles you would think would be vegan, but they have milk in them. They have whey in them and egg whites. Very strange. So I think I'm ready for dinner. It's been a couple of hours and I'm going to attempt the ultimate vegan dinner, tofu. Okay, for round two, I'm adding fresh breadcrumbs and some of this poultry rub seasoning to see if that gets it crispy. While those air fry, I'm gonna make some of this right rice to have with it, and then I'm gonna heat up some veggies. These look promising. Okay, so the tofu is still cooking in the air fryer, but I took out two pieces, one of the first batch and one of the second batch. This one already seems floppy. Let's just try the first one, because the second one's not cooked, I don't think. Really good. It kind of looks like chicken. It kind of tastes like chicken. It tastes like a chicken nugget. I think the trick is cutting it really thin and air frying it. So this is our base. It's just right rice with spinach, peas, corn, and carrots. Okay, happy dinner. This actually wasn't that difficult of a day. Like I would eat this exact meal, except air fry some chickpeas and put it on here. And honestly, I didn't even realize it was vegan. I thought I had this in the bag. And then I found out that graham crackers are not vegan. <laughs> I'm panicking. What do I eat? I'm gonna have some of these partake cookies. That really surprised me. There's honey in graham crackers. Maybe I need to do some research and find a different brand, but. So what did we learn? We learned that I'm 95% vegetarian, vegan already. I do eat sausage, chicken, and cheese and honey. Those are the two that I think I eat on a daily basis. Meat, I don't think I eat every day, but cheese and honey. Those are my kryptonites. But even this morning I made breakfast and I noticed that I made vegan French toast without doing it on purpose. So maybe I'm already partially vegan, 50% honorary vegan. Make me